Hey, what is up, everybody? This is Stevie Breach coming to you here today. It's been a long time since we've done WWE DVD Release Tuesday. Uh, but we are here with the best of Attitude Era Royal Rumble matches. This is a compilation DVD that just came out. Um, it, it's pretty much a re-release. A, a re if you have uh, the Royal Rumble uh, box set, I, I'm pretty sure you already have all of these. Uh, this is, uh, in their opinion, the Attitude Era is from 1997 through 2000. So you have 97, 98, 99, 2000. Um, that's, that's four years they, they've put together. Is it the double disc? Is it a single disc? Um, this 304 minutes, um, is, is how long they say this release is. I, I picked this up from Amazon. They, they delivered it to me. I'm sure you can find it at, uh, at Walmart. Yeah, I, I would debate heading to a Target or a Best Buy. Best Buy's DVD section is beyond the port of, uh, of hideous, but it's, it's a new release. Just came out today, January 24th. Also released is the A and E Biography Volume Three, maybe Volume Four. I think if they've instead of having double uh, releases, I think they've they've stuck them together. Uh, I, I picked that up from Amazon as well. I think I only paid twenty bucks for it, so maybe there's less biographies than the ones that came out. I'm, I'm guessing a year ago. I think there was. For any, it's been a while. Go check out the DVD. Uh, I'm sure, but uh, Attitude Era Royal Rumble matches. There's there's no matches, not even a hint. Um, we've got the Royal Rumble match itself, uh, where Austin's waiting on the on the ropes. Um, looks like we've got Undertaker. I can't tell what year that is, but it looks like a Royal Rumble match as well because it's got Diesel, Undertaker, Stone Cold, and uh, uh, Funk, uh, uh, not Terry Funk, but Too Cold, not Too Cold Scorpio either, Flash Funk, there we go, we got Edge and Draws, we've got, uh, The Big Show, I know this match here is from 2000, you know, when he's going up against, uh, Triple H, and then we got the, the 2000 Royal Rumble match itself, with Too Cool dancing in there, but there's no real matches that they, they, they tell you what's going to be on here. Is it the the Royal Rumble matches themselves? Is it the matches of the Royal Rumble pay-per-view? Um, off the top of my head, we've got WrestleMania 2000 when we've got Triple H versus uh, Mick Foley. That's possibly the, the best one I can think out of there. They've also got the, um, the, the, the match that's on... The uh, shoot, what documentary is that? Last time I tried to think of it, I couldn't remember the name of it either. But the Mick Foley uh, versus Rock uh, match when Rock just keeps on no, the I I quit match when he just keeps hitting him with the chair. Okay, comes with a free sticker that's just basically the cover of the disc itself, and then there's two discs in here. And there's no match listings. What a freaking waste. Why Why not just don't give us the sticker and give us a fucking insert where we know what matches are on here? This is... I know I, I pray for WWE to start pumping out DVDs. I still care about media like this. But this... Piss poor horrible. This is... Hopefully when I pop the disc in and I start watching these bad boys, it's worth it. But as of right now, I don't even know what I bought. <laughs> I mean, that's the God's honest truth. You guys got to head on over. I'm sure the, the people over at uh, WWE DVD News, um, they're not called that anymore. I'm sure the link still works. But DVD, Net no, is it Wrestling Network? Shit, I gotta post this now because I, I, but, I butchered in their name. But um, I'm sure they, they did the work for you. They can tell you what's on here. But here it is. I got it. <laughs> hey, what is up, everybody? This is Steve Breach coming to you here today. I know my house is in shambles as of right now. Uh, you can see no TV on the wall. 
but I uh, wanted to crank this one out as fast as I could before the uh, the painters get here today. Other day, I was really excited, DVD Tuesday, first one we had in a long time in, in WWE world. Um, we got the best of the Attitude Era Royal Rumble matches. Um, I, I bought this, honestly, because I thought it was going to be a best of the uh, the Royal Rumble from like uh, 97 through like 2001-ish. Um, we went over the, there's no match list things for this. You open it up, you get a sticker, but, but you don't get like an insert that actually tells you what this is. I actually popped this in for the first time, uh, just to actually see what it was. It's just the Royal Rumble matches themselves. It's just the Royal Rumble of 1997, the Royal Rumble of 1998, the Royal Rumble of 1999 on disc one. You take that out, you put in disc two, it's the Royal Rumble 2000. And then as a special feature, 2001. Um, I look at this picture right here of The Rock. Um, yeah, the Rock is probably in those Royal Rumble matches, but this picture itself is from 99, from the I Quit match. Um, I, I, I'm pretty damn sure this picture of, of Cactus Jack on the back is from 2000. Uh, from the, uh, uh, what kind of match, is it just a street fight that he has with, um, Triple H? I know a lot of these other pictures are actually from the Royal Rumble themselves, but I actually thought this was going to be like the matches of the Royal Rumble, uh, and you were going to get a lot of the really good singles matches. I know there's like a Benoit versus Angle match, I can't remember what year that was, probably one of the best matches from the Royal Rumble that I understand they're not going to be able to put on here, but... Man, I, I can honestly tell you, I didn't do my, uh, my due diligence. I didn't do my research. I, I didn't head over um, um, to WWE DVD News and, um, and see what was going to be on this. But I can honestly tell you, I wish I wouldn't have bought this brand new. I wish I would have waited six months, even a year, um, and bought this used off of somebody else who didn't want it in their collection anymore. This, this right here... Um, Probably brand new, I'm guessing, is probably going to be, if you go buy it right now, probably in the range of like 16, 18 bucks, I'm guessing. In a year, this is probably going to be like a 5 to $6 DVD. If you go used market, you're probably even going to go cheaper than that. Um, I don't know who to blame, WWE, Warner Brothers, but this right here is the crap that's going to kill DVD sales. They have a, a, a huge, huge library that they don't really use enough of on Peacock. And um, this right here is very easily reachable on Peacock. If I would have known about this, there's no way I would have pulled the trigger on buying this one. Uh, I haven't opened up my um, biographies. Um, WB Legends one that had like the Bella Twins and other ones that came out Tuesday. Um, but that's something that, that they can hang their hat on. I don't know if they make money off that. A&E makes money off that, but uh, that can keep WWE DVDs going. This right here, what the fuck was that? Not good. 